Mr. Mboda, command of the Nigerian Customs Service, has handed over 6 million fake dollar bills to the Economic and Financial Crimes Commission. The command also confiscated seven tankers of premium metal spirits smuggled out of the country and thousands of 50 kg powerboard rice between January and March. Ifonaya Eze reports. As he handed over the intercepted 6 million fake dollar bills to officials of the Economic and Financial Crimes Commission, Comptroller Dera Nadi listed other items seized by the command during the first quarter, including 550 pieces of donkey skin, six Maltese passports with the same picture but different names, and two Senegalese passports with the same picture. According to him, the seven tankers contained 227,610 liters of premium motor spirit with a duty paid value of 51.07 million naira. Also intercepted at the border were thousands of dead rodents and birds, as well as monkey skin and parcels of cannabis sativa. Why this is significant, again, is because we keep wondering why somebody will want to import or export dead tiny birds. What we've done is to go on research and we found out that there are it's international syndicates that specialize in doing this. In accordance with the ECOWAS trade liberalization scheme, the command facilitated 425 trucks with fees amounting to 314.7 million naira. Additionally, it processed 412 baggage declarations worth 58.8 million naira in duty. One of the commanders of the service in Semi as elsewhere is trade facilitation. The command is conscious of its strategic location as the foremost frontier for trade and tourism in West and Central Africa. Particularly the promotion of the ECOWAS trade liberalization scheme, ETLS, and the Imagine African Continental Free Trade Agreement, ACFA. Although revenue shortfalls were recorded during the period, the controller attributed it to trade barriers along the corridor. Ifunanya Eze, TVC News, Lagos.